Hi everybody, I'm Boaz Fala and I'm here with the daily astrology forecast for the 2nd of March 2016. And the moon is in Sagittarius today and it's <clears throat> conjuncting Saturn. You're going to feel it especially if you are in Europe. America, it will be still in your bedtime. But if you are in Europe, this conjunction is a very important thing to notice today. A conjunction to Saturn, to the moon Saturn, could uh, confront us with issues of support for my environment and just feeling this cold feeling that is coming towards us we could be colder ourselves and more rigid and we need to watch that but it's about dealing with your insecurities it's about dealing with your own self-worth and uh, generally after that you know there's a there's a trying to Uranus and there's a sextile to Venus and there's a square to Jupiter and then there's a square to Chiron so we could be feeling through this day a lot of the pains and aches that we have inside. And this is a time that we are called not to be extra extravagant, not to be too cocky, and uh, to really, if we do need satisfaction within our relationships, and I'm not talking only about personal or romantic relationships, any kind of relationship within our lives, if we need that support, if we need that warmth, if we need that satisfaction and we're not getting it, we are called to do the changes ourselves, to implement them ourselves, to renew and restructure <clears throat> everything that needs to be restructured and renewed so we would be more satisfied in our life. And it calls us to understand that this is our job more than anybody else's in our life. Venus is sextiling Uranus and it's Queen Kongsing Jupiter really talking about the same theme that's going on through these days to find new ways to get satisfaction through our relationships, to renew and to learn to do what is satisfying for us in a sensitive way towards others. Not disregarding their feelings and not stepping over them, but finding ways that are sensitive, accepted and still bring that new atmosphere and that sense of satisfaction back into our lives. Remember that Jupiter is Queen Kongxing Uranus in the sky at this time as well. This is a time to remain disciplined and not to rebel and not to uh, really not give enough thanks or honor to things that are already there. Thank you for listening and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.